Hi, I'm Deepa Joshi. I would be explaining about the performance issues with respect to Salesforce lookup transformation. First, let's try to understand what is a Salesforce lookup transformation and how it is different from a normal lookup. Then, I will show you the issue related to its performance and a different approach you can follow to overcome the issue. Salesforce lookup is an active transformation. Unlike a normal lookup, it does not cache the output. It returns all the matching rows on a lookup condition. To create a lookup transformation, you need to use this icon. You need to feed in the username, password and the service URL which connects to Salesforce and you need to select the object on which you want to create the lookup transformation. I have created the lookup transformation on account object. There are two ports which are created by default, lookup filter and lookup match index ID. Lookup filter is used to add a filter condition to the lookup query and match ID port which assigns an unique sequence ID for the multiple matched row outputs. These are some of the issues when Salesforce lookup transformation is used in the mappings. This sends SOQL query to the Salesforce URL for every source record. If there are millions of records in the source, millions of SOQLs will be fired to the Salesforce database. A user may reach the API limit usage at the Salesforce site. Because of many SOQLs being fired, and not caching the data makes the session run very slow. Let me explain you using a simple example. I have created a simple mapping where source data is matched with the Salesforce lookup object before inserting into the target. In this mapping, Salesforce lookup is being created for account object an ID column is mapped from the source. There are around 37 records in the source. When we check the session log, we can see that there are 37 SOQLs fired to the Salesforce against each and every input row based on the ID condition given. And we can see it has taken around 50 seconds to process 37 records. Let's see how we can redesign the same logic by using a pipeline lookup instead of Salesforce lookup. You can see I have imported the account Salesforce object as a source and then I have just dragged it in the mapping as another source. Now instead of Salesforce lookup, I create a normal lookup and select this account source to create the lookup transformation. This is called a pipeline lookup from the source. I will match the ID of the incoming source to the ID of the account in the lookup. Please note, this lookup transformation will no longer have the Salesforce connection. Instead, there will be the second source which I imported 
which will have the Salesforce connection. When I see this session log, I see that only a single SOQL is being executed to fetch all the lookup data. And we can see it just took two seconds to process 37 records. Please make use of pipeline lookups in case of Salesforce lookups to improve the performance. We would love to hear from you at the addresses given below. Thank you.